And today, Celebrate New Mexico, an incredible piece of art. It took the local artist nearly 10 years to finish and is a unique view of Hispanic heritage. Yeah, there's a lot to experience at the National Hispanic Cultural Center. Music, theater, culinary arts, you name it. Well, today we're focused on an absolute showstopper when it comes to visual arts combined with history. This is what it's like walking into the Torreon, a massive, stunning piece of art that goes through the history of Hispanic culture. Something very interesting was the wheel. So that was over, brought over with the caretas. Frederico Vigil was the artist on this project. He was born and raised in Santa Fe. He says the title sums up the piece. Mundos de mestizaje, meaning a mixture as to who we are. All of us included are mixtures of genetics from different areas. He did all the art. A team of PhDs helped him with how Hispanic culture came to be. He said they helped him form this incredible visual, showcasing the influences from the Iberian Peninsula, the Romans, Phoenicians, Mesoamerica, Celts and Pueblo peoples, among others. Apples, cherries, apricots and prunes brought over. The painting is more than 4,000 square feet, nearly the size of a basketball court. It took just about 10 years to finish. The style of art is called fresco. Frederico says one of the oldest ancient noble art forms goes back to 3000 BCE. It's a calcium mixture, kind of like a plaster, that you then paint over. The beauty of fresco, it, it doesn't allow you to sit down and relax and to take a look at it. You have to paint it while it's wet. It's a lot to see. Take your time, soak it in. It's stunning. There's so much history. The National Hispanic Cultural Center offers guided tours of the fresco on Thursdays and Fridays at 11 a.m. I mean, Byron, it's even on the ceiling. It's huge. It's it's tough to really summarize how big it is. And it's tough to see through the video even. Yeah, and just amazing those vivid colors and the mm -hmm. history that it tells and the story as well. It's just something that would be so cool to see in person. I bet you were just kind of getting a neck cramp after yeah, looking up right, at it for so right. long. Well, and it's it's 360 too, right? So you're just uh, spinning around the whole time. Yeah, it's pretty make sure you have your hands out so you can there you go, right? Run Keep into your balance. <laughs>